So Deanna had a real, quite a run last season, didn't she? Where, where is she when we, when we pick up? Do we pick up immediately at where things ended or has some time passed? We pick up where things have ended. So what is her state of mind at this point? I would say she is hollowed out. She is so unspeakably devastated. There, there's no language. It would be like the language of mass massacre in Rwanda. I mean, she's lost her husband, first her son, and then her husband in short order. So it's only she and Spencer, she and her other son that are left. And it was so summary, so quick, so unexpected that it will transform her for the rest of her life. What is her relationship with Rick going to be like moving forward? Excellent. Darwin, it is not the most intelligent or the strongest who survive. It is those who can adapt. And what kind of threats from beyond the camp or beyond the town are we going to see? We know the wolves are out there. Uh, there's a lot of other factions from the comics that fans are waiting to see. Uh, are we going to see some of those coming to the forefront as well? The threats will magnify. And the threats will magnify as our fear outside of television magnifies with weapons of mass destruction being put in unsavory hands. So the threats will magnify and then the question is who remains a human being and who becomes a beast? And will Diana become a warrior or will she remain just a stateswoman? I'll let you think through that answer.